Hey horse lovers, welcome back to Free Spirit Equestrian. My name is Shay and I am staying at a luxury equestrian resort in Mexico. The resort is absolutely beautiful. It's called Rancho Las Cascadas and it is breathtaking. I cannot wait to take you on a tour of the facility, show you around and of course ride horses. We're gonna be riding the Criolla horses. They are a native breed and they're absolutely stunning. They have a lot of endurance and athleticism as well and it's gonna be so much fun. All right, let's go. Now I'm gonna take you on a tour of this beautiful resort. First, we're gonna go to the stables because obviously that's gonna be the best part. So these are their paddocks. I really like how they have a ton of space. They have cactuses in there, they have trees, they have a big watering hole. It is really neat. Now the tires are set up to stimulate natural feeding. It gets them to walk around, eat out of different tires and locations, and they get their herd mates as well. So that's really lovely. Here, the horses are getting their extra feed and eating their breakfast. Next, we're gonna take a peek into the tack room, which is amazing. As you can see, I love all the saddles. I love the decor that they have in here. They have helmets you can borrow or you can bring your own gear as well. Really cool to see all the hats hung up. I absolutely love this place. All of the horses are very friendly. They look happy and healthy. They love to get treats and pets. They are so adorable. It's just so cool to see a different type of facility. I love it. Now I'm going to show you our room and where we're going to be staying. So this is really cool. There's several different rooms in this building, but I'm going to show you ours and then another one so you get an idea of what you could book if you ever came here. And then this is the view. So the stables are to the right and then they have all this land and landscaping. The brick paths are gorgeous. I just think this is so beautiful. It's out in a rural area, but it's so nice and you just get that luxury feel. It is incredible. I love all the fountains that they have too. Okay, it's time to go in and see my room. I'm so excited. I love all the painting that they have on the walls as well. Wow, this is awesome. Okay, so there's the first room. You have the two twin beds here. So if you have extra people with you, they could stay in this room. You have a little desk to the right of you. Oh my gosh, look at that bathtub. I'm obsessed with bathtubs and that is stunning. You have the couch and the gorgeous windows. You have those curtains, they're like sheer, you can pull them. King size bed, you have the mini bar. And now we're gonna go into the bathroom now. Okay, so we have the toilet here and the shower. Look at the tile work, that's so unique. I love the flowers as well. Like it's like kind of like river rock, amazing. This is so cool, I'm so excited. It's like better than I could have ever expected. I am so excited to stay in this room. This is so fun. Okay, now I'm going to head out and show you another one of the rooms as an example. So this one just has two full-size beds. And then you have a little sitting area where you have your coffee, a bench, you have a dresser, and then the bathroom. So this is really cool if you're like a single traveler or just a couple people and you want something a little smaller. As you can see, they have several fountains, beautiful flowers, furniture, just areas to relax. And this is what's called the main house. So we're gonna explore that a little bit. I love all of the decor. It is just perfect. They have a bunch of fun pottery. This is the main fountain, the first thing you see when you pull in. So it's really big and stoic, it's gorgeous. Okay, let's head into the main house and let me show you what that looks like. You're gonna love it. This is the center point of the main house and you can actually book a room right here. If you look to the right, those are actual rooms and you have the tables where you can sit and relax. If you walk straight in, they have like a lounge area. We'll sit here and drink coffee or pina coladas. I love it. Then if you head in here, this is the breakfast area. I love all the windows. It makes it so bright. They serve breakfast here every day. Here's the breakfast bar. Delicious, such a variety. They set your table and serve you every meal. It's lovely. This is their beautiful infinity pool. I love how it's so big. It's surrounded by gorgeous flowers. You can lounge here. Love that horse statue as well. Everything is so beautiful. And then if you head down these stairs, you see that bench, that's where we eat lunch every day. And then this awesome jacuzzi as well. This here is the yoga studio. And I think this is the most beautiful room. 
It's also surrounded by these waterfalls, hence the name Rancho Las Cascadas, which means waterfalls. This yoga studio slash meditation room is gorgeous. It's definitely my favorite room. Look how beautiful it is. Okay, this is absolutely wild. So we got here yesterday, we traveled all day long and the resort host Jenny, which I'll introduce you to her later, she was saying, okay, so another girl is gonna be arriving today. She might join you on the afternoon ride, you know, talking about that. We walk out and I go to meet my horse for the first time. And all of a sudden this girl is like walking up and as I get closer, I'm like, wait a second. Hmm. And she's like, Shay? And I'm like, Lauren? And we're like oh freaking <laughs> out and nobody got it on film, but it was hilarious. So she literally lives in Mich <laughs> Michigan. <laughs> yes. So she literally lives in Michigan. She's ridden Jiminy before. I've done saddle fitting for her. Yeah, it's like small we're in, world. Yes, like we're literally in the middle of Mexico. Like how could that <laughs> even work out? Like the same timing, the same place. Like it was just crazy. So I'm super excited yes, she's here. So excited. And yes, so she's gonna be riding with us and it's like having another friend here. It's awesome. Yep. Okay, so we're getting ready to head out soon. We're gonna be mounting up. It's gonna be so fun. Look at the horse I get to ride, horse lovers. Obviously, you can tell why I'm super excited. If you don't know, then you haven't been watching me long enough. <laughs> All right, I just got on Capriccio. We're gonna have such a fun ride today. It's so beautiful out. This place is just magical. Kyle is here as well. He's riding Navajo. And then this is Mel, she's from Australia. We are all mounted up and we are leaving the ranch now. I cannot wait to see the trails. I think they're gonna be just beautiful. It is unbelievably beautiful here. I'm impressed with the landscape. And we're gonna head through a few small towns now and then we're gonna get to Cantor. Smile. What I am loving about this place so far is that you get to walk and relax on the trails, you get to canter and gallop, you get to go through all the little towns and immerse yourself in the culture, you get to see all the livestock along the trail. It is amazing and it's so cool. Riding Capriccio has been really fun so far. He has very smooth gates, he's responsive, he is so cool. At this ranch, they have over 30 guided trails, so you always have one to two wranglers with you, and they are so fun. They set the pace, they do what you wanna do, and they keep you safe, and they've all been fantastic. Not humid. Right now, we are riding in the Mexican highlands. There are so many wildflowers, it is unbelievable. I'm surprised at how lush it is. We're gonna be heading to a gorgeous field soon and I cannot wait to see what they look like. It's gonna be so beautiful. Okay, we are almost at the wildflower field and I cannot wait to show you.
I don't know about you, but I literally just lived out my horse girl dream cantering through a field of wildflowers. It is incredible. I can't believe that just happened. Well, that was like pure magic. Right? <laughs> oh, good boy. I just let sneak you on the plane. No one will know. No joke, that was seriously the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Right now there's a very loud train, so that's what the noise is, and it's going right under that bridge, right to the left of us. So we are gonna cross the bridge, and then we're gonna go to a little town, get a snack, drink some water. It's gotten a little hot out, so we're getting tired. We've been out for about two and a half hours so far. Carlo wouldn't give two Fs. <laughs> That's so cool. They're adorable. Oh my gosh, that little one, look at the little, one. The little puppy. For those of you wondering, yes, the horses have shoes on all four hooves, so they're shot all the way around. And this breed is bred to be able to go for miles. They have a lot of endurance and they're very hardy and can handle this type of terrain. Okay, now we're gonna take a little break, give the horses a rest. We got some food and snacks and some drinks in this mom and pop shop. It was really good. A oh, cute! A lizard. It almost looked like a bearded dragon, but.
He has the cactus. Like a dog oh, the bowl. <laughs> I want to go. I reckon I could do it. And that's what it's like. I really hope you're enjoying the ride so far, horse lovers. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear what you're thinking. That's like a puppy. Is that one barking? So funny. They just have like these clans. We're heading back to the ranch now. That was a beautiful ride. Like I can't even describe how amazing it was in person. I really hope that you like seeing ride number one of this equestrian vacation. It has been phenomenal thus far and it's just now started. All right, horse lovers, it's day two of our trip. We started off with breakfast. They have two Belgian Malinois and one of them sits like this. Her name's Cookie. Is that not hilarious? She is so sweet. They're very friendly. I saw these super cute frogs. I'm like obsessed with all the animals here. They're so fun to see. Kyle really enjoyed riding Navajo, so he's riding him again. They do great together. That's Jenny. She is fantastic. She's a hospitality manager here. Really awesome. And I'm riding Capriccio again. I had a lot of fun on him. He was really smooth, and he's obviously gorgeous. So we are heading out for another fantastic ride. Obviously, we are leaving the ranch now, and let's see what today has in store for us. Hope you're enjoying this so far, horse lovers. I know I am. At the ranch, we are riding in the Mexican Charo saddles. So they have a much larger horn and that's pretty much used for roping. They're actually pretty comfortable, but it did take a little bit getting used to because you sit so much wider and that just takes more adjusting, but I actually really do like them. This is so fun. This is one of the Wranglers. His name is Luis. He's been great. Kyle and Navajo. Capricho. Oh well, you know, you get the you get the point. Oh well, I'm gonna call it Navajo. Nice fleece thing you got going on there. The fleece pack. I was surprised the canter was so comfortable. I'm on Capriccio. Isn't he so cute? They offer two rides a day, morning and evening. So that's super exciting because then we can ride twice a day and you can choose which horse you want to ride. I don't, I'm really liking Capriccio for obvious reasons, but he's been a good boy so far.
great. You're getting better. You're turning into a real cowboy now. What I love most about riding out here in Mexico so far is not only the scenic views, but I just feel so free. This is just fantastic. Like I can't imagine a better vacation for an equestrian. This is just awesome. I'm also really proud of Kyle. He's come so far in his riding journey and he can keep up. He can canter now and gallop and hang out with us. And it's just really nice to be able to share that together. <laughs> yeah. Good boy, good boy. We jumped the rocks. <laughs> That's funny. This is absolutely gorgeous. We are at the top of the hill right now overlooking the valley and it is breathtakingly beautiful. The video doesn't do justice. That ride was so cool. We are now heading back to the ranch. We are getting close and then I think we're just gonna hang out for a little bit, but I really hope you enjoyed this day two second ride, horse lovers. Hi, oh baby, hi babies. Oh my God, I want this one. Oh, that one. 
Oh my e, I need it. I need it. They really have. <laughs> that is funny. Those cows are fuzzy and cute. I think they're similar. Yes, it is. He followed us. <laughs> the landscaping is so pretty. I can't even like keep my little, I don't even ha barely have landscaping. I can't even keep it organized. Welcome to the ranch. <gasps> Is that the arena? That's cool. Trying to catch more fish. Too. Yes. You still trying to catch fish? So funny. Was the first one faster? I see. Was this cooler? Like the temperature? Nice. Right there? Nice. Kind of has some roaning. A little bit. Hello. There's a palomino. Well, kind of. Oh, good boy. It was so beautiful. We had so much fun cantering and moving out. The landscape was gorgeous. And we're gonna get ready to eat dinner in a little bit. And then I'll show you a little bit more of what we do this evening. Okay, so we had a fantastic ride. Now I have this amazing pina colada and I'm gonna go in the hot tub and just relax. Cannot wait to ride again tomorrow. And then later we're gonna get massages and then we're gonna have our four course dinner. So yay, this is amazing. I hope you're loving it, horse lovers. Okay, horse lovers, I really hope you enjoyed our first two days here at this beautiful resort, Rancho Las Cascadas. It was absolutely amazing. So we had wonderful meals. The dinners were great. Our massages were awesome. And we're super tired, so we're going to get ready to go to bed here soon. And I will be posting a follow-up video so you can see the next few days of our amazing adventures here in Mexico. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notifications so you don't miss anything Free Spirit Equestrian. Also, don't forget to buy some super cute free spirit equestrian merch you can check out that link in the description the spirited horse boutique okay horse lovers i'll see you soon bye